email notifications. So if I go into the email notifications, you've got your email address, set uh, notifications sent to you, uh, uh, form filing notifications. So you're gonna get your email payday notifications and so on. So I typically would keep the, the defaults to get that information, payday notifications on, send same day, submission due, send day before. So you have an option to get it on or before tax payment reminders. So those are your re reminder settings. Let's go to the next one, email profile management. So going into that one, uh, let employees edit their info in workforce. We'll send you an email when any changes are made so they can possibly make the changes. Remember that we entered the data into the system based on their W-2 form. And we had the option of, I mean, sorry, their W-4 form. And we had the option of basically sending them an email and letting them uh, make the changes based on their W-4 form. Our responsibility is to take the information that they gave us and then file the withholdings or do the withholdings in accordance with the law based on that information. Our obligation is not generally to give them tax advice, right? We're, we're, we're just facil we're just the collect tax collecting mechanism with regards to payroll taxes. They got to give us the information to do so, which is the W-4 form, which hopefully they can they can basically give to us automatically, you know, into QuickBooks on their end, which would be great. Shared data. So here's our shared data. Allow employees to import W-2 data into uh, TurboTax. So TurboTax is owned by by uh, Intuit, the same owner of QuickBooks. So if you can get, so, you know, they're trying to do some integration between making it easier to go from the taxes to filing the bookkeeping to filing the taxes and the w-2s and stuff it's uh that integration is not perfect to me yet but i mean if they can uh improve it that would be great i i check in on it from time to time to see to see if i think it's uh how uh, how effective it is but connect your bank and send money uh with quickbooks to use direct deposit to pay your workforce as well as e-file and e-pay your taxes you need to connect your bank account so you got your bank account for the direct pay stuff which we'll, we'll not get into at this point and then we've got uh employee profile so let employees edit there we did that shared data and then bank accounts something that's not quite right with your bank accounts i'm not going to go into that printing so something is not quite right with it give us a few minutes to try again 